Hi world and welcome back to the Unfiltered and Real Talk channel and also welcome back to another episode of Karen's podcast show live and direct from the UK and I'm your host, writer, creator and producer Karen once again. Hello, <laughs> hello world. Well it's a beautiful sunny day out here in the UK where I live it's so beautiful and gorgeous, by the way. I'm not complaining. <laughs> anyway, enough about the weather. How are you all doing? Well, I hope you all are, you know, having a swell time, regardless. You know, and a safe one too. And I hope you all are taking good care of yourselves and loved ones. And all those that matter most to you too. And I know that, you know, there's a lot going on in the world at the moment, including the hate online and offline. Oh my goodness, it's terrible. But hey ho, you gotta handle these issues with respect and dignity, smartness, professionalism, stay positive, stay strong, and keep those people that love you closer to you. Okay, because they're like gold. These people can go a long way in your lives, okay? And also to my regular listeners, thanks for tuning in, by the way. Thanks for being a lawyer and thanks for spreading the word. And also, if you've got any comments, please drop them below and I shall get back to you, you know, in due course. And also for my new listeners, thanks for tuning in, by the way, wherever you are on the map, you're highly appreciated. I hope you are doing okay, doing all right. And, you know, I hope you all are taking good care of yourselves, the loved ones and all those that matter most to you too. And also, like I said previously, I know that there's a lot going on in the world at the moment, but hey-ho, you got to, you know, defeat the haters, you know, whether they're offline or online. You know, you got to handle these people, handle these issues with respect and dignity, you know, don't stoop to their level, okay, you know, you got to play smart, you got to play with professionalism, stay strong, stay positive, and keep those that love you closer, okay, because they're like gold, all right, haven't mentioned that on this show, we talk about a hell of a lot, <laughs> I beg your pardon, <laughs> with all due respect, we talk about a hell of a lot. We talk about controversial matters, we talk about, you know, sensitive matters, those topics that people don't like talking about. Oh, yes, we talk about those topics here because we are transparent like that, okay? And also we talk about lifestyle matters because we know life is full of ups and downs. Everybody's going through one journey or the other. But hey-ho, you got to stay smart. You know, play professionalism as always. You know, stay strong, stay positive, and keep those that love you close, okay? To get by, as far as I'm concerned. And we move. And also, we talk about celebrity life, we talk about entertainment news, we talk about success stories. You know, I've got a couple of success stories on this platform that can, you know, help you you know, as far as your life is concerned. And also, I've posted one this one about LeBron James. If you haven't tuned into that, please do. And spread the word as well. And another success story I would like to mention is about Lewis Hamilton. Okay, he's well known. He has created his mark in his industry, which is racist. Okay. And Lewis Hamilton won his eighth British Grand Prix pricks last Sunday congratulations to him you know and you know I know he's been going through a lot lately but all I can say to him is that you know stay strong stay positive be focused on your game you know and keep those that love you closer okay and you move and I wish you all the best all right, and also we talk about legal matters as well. We talk about you know human rights issues, philanthropy matters, and so much more. Okay, all right. Without any further ado, let's just dive into the scoop of today. Well, the scoop of today is that you know Dr. Dre. Yep, as you all know, 
you know, since June last year, we've been talking about his divorce in court with his estranged wife, Nicole Young. Well, he's been ordered by the court recently to bring his checkbook out, you know, to pay spousal support to his estranged wife, Nicole Young. And apparently, he's going to be paying nearly um, $300,000 per month in spousal support to Nicole Young, commencing the first of next month from my understanding wow wow well that's it guys for today i hope you enjoyed it like subscribe stay safe stay strong stay positive keep your loved ones closer to you and i shall see you in my next
so so